My name's Adam Short and welcome to the UK Coastal Track. Well today I am here at Hollyhead and uh, going to be having a look around the Mersey class lifeboat. It's one of the biggest in the fleet. Now I'll, I'll be honest, it's pretty impressive, albeit on the old side compared to the Shannons. Oh, I was lucky enough to be shown around a Tamar, which is all fly by wire. This one's a little older, although she is being refitted with uh, some new computer technology. Very soon, I've been told. Now where I'm sat now is where the coxswain pilots the boat. Bloody great steering wheel, everything he needs throttle controlled. Pretty impressive. Got a good old view of, of what's going on around him. And this is where navigation takes place. Uh, just behind me here, this is where the most important person on board the ship sits. It's the mechanic. Without him, if things went wrong, the whole boat would be dead in the water. It's turned out to be another absolutely fantastic sunny day and what's better is my pack has been ferried from Hollyhead to the next station which gives me the freedom to really enjoy this walk which to be honest with you isn't challenging whatsoever. There's been plenty of activity with climbers and, and hikers walking around Holy Island and they've left these trails uh, pretty much right on the edge of the island couldn't get much closer to the sea if I'd really wanted to try. It's almost like the challenge is uh, almost over. Well, that's something you don't see every day. Uh, it's the RAF rescue helicopter and they are doing a few exercises in the area. Uh, and here they come again.
as you can see, no I ever rescuing. What are there a few? Stuck down the road beneath me. That's how the RAF rescue it is like me. I'm liking it. But for me, that is one of the special experiences that makes this challenge just something really unique. You never really know what you're gonna come across while you're out here hiking the coastline. And to see that firsthand so close, absolutely phenomenal.